Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, The Blood Samurai. Right? My name is Sam and today we're back playing Magic Grass. So yeah, this is a game that I'm really getting more into, especially now that I have the full game. So I'm looking forward to it. The last The last build was insane. I thought it was crazy. Um Let's see, what do we get? Um oh okay. So faster cooldown, okay. Interesting. Any loot? Any little bit of loot around? Doesn't seem like it. Okay, he. Okay, didn't think I forgot that he does that. And the shadow serpent. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just focus on this, I guess. Let's see, okay. Nice. That is, that's actually really cool. I like that. Look at that. Look how cool that is. You just send out a shadow serpent to deal with all the enemies. Definitely not the strongest projectile, but certainly a pretty cool one. Taking a little bit of damage, but it's okay. Uh, the completion of the spell. Wait, what? Hover in place for two seconds at the completion. I guess I don't understand what that means. Whoa! Wait, what if I do... That actually seems really sick. Okay. Like, yeah, that, that like pairs really well with this thing. Okay. That's, that actually seems really sick. Okay. Max HP, body size, with that. Does that increase the radius of this thing? I assume so. Uh, okay, I become a little bit bigger. Does that also affect this? I would assume so, but I'm not sure. Oh. Sure. I'll take some coins. Oh my gosh, it's actually such a sick thing. I'm not sure how exactly it reacts with the stuff that's getting dropped on the floor. It doesn't seem like I take damage. Oh, it's, oh this stuff just slows me down. Okay. It doesn't actually deal damage to me. So it doesn't really seem like I'm able to like actually... Can I control with this thing? I'm not sure. Like it, I don't think I can control it, but maybe I can and I'm just not doing it properly. I'm not sure. Spring, coin. This is so cool. 
Okay, I, I like this. I like this build so far. Like, I love this this spell. Oh, okay. I thought there was going to be more enemies that were going to spawn there. Take the coins. Fight the elite. Hey, I'm going to I kind of do what you do. I dash around. Okay, I don't think I can be a hurt while Oh, I just straight up destroyed the I don't even think I can be hurt while I'm in that, like, that phase. Okay. But then when I come out of that phase, then I can come to the game. So, is it cooldown that I need to reduce? I'm actually not sure. I'm not sure what would make it so that it doesn't last as long, but okay. Um, go with this. So I think I can control it, kind of. Yeah, I can. Okay. It's a little difficult, but it is controllable. A controllable is what I was trying to say there. Oh, they merge into... Okay. Yeah, see, that hover thing is actually insane. Now... out of that form. Uh, use to increase my HP. Yeah, sure. Let's see, what is this? 30 shield. Meteor. Very critical hit. Uh, oh, this doesn't have a spell. Okay. Yeah, see, so like, I can go with that, but then that reduces the spell duration, which I don't want. I do that, right? Like that. Does it like it hovers in place or Oh, this thing would actually I think be pretty good then. Okay, well I'm gonna go with this thing for now, but I can see the other thing being really good. If I can get a good setup with it, like I think that would actually be insane. Oh, 
Oh my gosh. Okay, there's no more. Okay, the only problem is you can't really dodge when you're in that phase. I also don't think they can destroy these things. The only way I can destroy like trees and things like that is with other other stuff. Which is fine. Oh my gosh. Poison is definitely pretty obnoxious thing that to be dealing with. I wonder if you could theoretically farm the slime. It does seem like they kind of like obviously shoot out more slime. So like and speed targeted and put this spell. Yeah, I can definitely see some pretty crazy synergy arising with this, this strategy. I'm just not sure if I'm going to be actually, actually able to pull off those strategies, but we'll hope for the best. Oh, yeah, okay. That's also one of the more dangerous strategies. Yeah, you can't really move at, after you leave the hover mode. So I'm just gonna put down a bunch of these. Hope for the best. I think this is going to be the better strategy overall, though. Like with these things. Just because you can put them anywhere and they'll attack all over the place. Okay. I'm noticing a problem. We're dealing with groups of enemies, not so good. Mainly because it, it is difficult to get multiple or get a ton of them down. So if I can figure out a better strategy for getting a bunch of them down, then then maybe I would be okay. This one, then probably that one. Okay, it's not that one. That one, that one. Oh, come on. That one, that one, that one. How about for you? Thank you. 
very confused about what is happening right now. Um, I'm gonna do that. that on that oh okay I see I see I see okay so I could have two different ones going right so I'll do something like this okay So I'll kind of have almost this one just as a way of like keeping myself alive. Projectiles just do not go far. I like this, I like this. I can just like go to the opposite side, let this guy actually like do the fighting. I definitely need a better projectile, but or what about doing that? Maybe that looks better. That is way cheaper if I... Okay. Simultaneous fi uh, firing allows characters to fly while holding the floor. Uh, 
I'll probably like still keep this guy for this. Keep this for this one. I would have liked the other one as well, but it's okay. Oh my gosh. See how fast it fires out. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna get rid of the hover thing, because hovering in place doesn't really matter. What matters is actually being able to like not die. So it's like that, this guy will be for the damage, and then I just need something that's gonna, you know, keep me alive. It's like, I can still deal damage if I want to, but for the most part, I want to be focused on not taking damage. And just being able to travel across the But yeah, like I said, still do still deal damage, but it's not what this strategy is about. Cause yeah, when I'm when I'm trying to deal damage, then I end up taking damage. So that's the problem. That don't really do a good job at like actually preventing myself from dying. Uh, let's go with that. Definitely could use with like a faster projector. What is this worm thing? Why is he so freaking huge? Oh my gosh, how many enemies are there? That'll be better. Let's see if we can get something good. Spell damage, okay. Oh, hello. I never expected to find another human here. I thought I was done for. They always said the fortress was impenetrable, but who knew the monsters would break through. Camp, cool, I'll head over there right now. Right away. Here's something I found earlier. Hope it helps. Let's see. Spell effect radius. Let's try that.
They're a cheaper projectile to use. I mean, the floating wisp are cheap. But... Oh my god, okay. Ow. Oh my gosh, okay. I am not doing a good job. Let me go with that. I am, uh, about dead. Let's just do that. an expel. Wait, so if I... Okay. thinking, right, like, if I do something like that, Cube. I don't really have a good thing for it. I want the healing though. Definitely need the healing. Let me go here. Um. Anything now? Oh, that 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 would actually be crazy. Um, spell penetration wouldn't matter. That okay, this is actually okay. okay. If I get rid of that, Something that's gonna like now it'll hover in place. Okay, I like that. I like that. 
Um. I guess I could put like that stuff down. actually a build that I really like so far. Like I have, I actually have confidence in this, in this build. But, uh, tag, spells can penetrate walls. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. I'll go with that. Yeah, let's go for relics.
hurting quite a bit. Okay, so there's like, yeah, so the fuse thing. something that's like not, you know, outside of the arena. I want to see what actually happens. Huh. Yo, I think that's still better, but that is pretty cool. Are you okay, sir? You're just uploading it. wouldn't be that that bad of an idea. There we go. Enchanting I really thought this would be over by now, but okay. Oh, I got 
Can I just sit here and they just exist? I don't, I don't think I actually have to do anything. I think it's just... I mean, okay, I can just sit, I can just sit still and not even have to worry. This is just a nice thing. I'm not sure exactly how this works, I kind of am curious if I can like this up. Because I'm thinking like obviously, oh, oh there we go. But does it use gold coins? Like... Or... I think I need the house. Like, yeah, I can grab the gold coins, obviously. But... Oh my gosh. I'm gonna just do this. Oh my gosh, can this guy stop spawning? Like this guy here. Really annoying. Everywhere I go, he's just right there. You gotta have a little bit better aim than this, okay? Come on, little wand guy. There we go. hard to tell where you're gonna end up at because it just kind of randomly stops but we got a new character now so we'll see how this goes choosing the right fabric is crucial crucial different textures to offer different quality you like my new outfit 
girl you rescued, Le uh, Leia, is a Leia, Leia, a fashion designer who can craft different wands and robes. Ask her to make you a set too. Thanks again, hero. You're yep, yep, whatever. Okay, let's see. Main new gear. Do I just do I have different? Oh, 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 okay. Uh, oh, okay. I'll control your wand, allowing casting spells up to five feet. Whoa! That's sick! Um, I'll grab that. Okay, but yeah, I think that's gonna be it for today's video of Magicraft. This is such a sick uh, game, though, and I, I really do love it. Um, but yeah, um, if you guys enjoyed it, please leave a like on it and subscribe to the channel. It means the world to me. It doesn't cost you guys anything. And yeah, I hope to see you guys in the next one. You guys take care.